Let somebody shout hallelujah. hallelujah. Our God is awesome. Yes, Jesus. And he is a faithful God. Thank you, Jesus. Let us wave our hands to Jesus. Let us appreciate his holy name, his word. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus, for strength. Thank you, Jesus, for provision. Thank you, Jesus, for protection. Thank you for everything you've done for us, Lord. We are grateful. Thank you, Jesus. You've been faithful, God. From the ages past. That is why your name, your name is forevermore. You've been faithful, oh God, from the ages past. That is why your name is forevermore. Tori Kweshe Anu Yiduro Tori Kweshe Anu Yiduro Tori Kweshe Tori Kweshe Tori Kweshe I know you Oh, Zana, blessed be the Lord. Let the rock of my salvation be exalted. Oh, Zana.
Let somebody shout hallelujah. 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 Thank you, Jesus. Our dance offering to the Most High God. Amen. Say, you and I will praise the Lord. You and I will praise the Lord. You and I, you and I, you and I will praise the Lord. We will praise the Lord. We will praise the Lord. We will praise Jehovah. We will praise the Lord. Yeah, yeah. You and I, you and I, you and I, you and I will praise the Lord. I say you and I will praise the Lord. Oh, Baba, 
Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise the living Jesus. Hallelujah. It's a wonderful night. Yes. It's going to be a night of your testimony. Amen. I'm so excited that this man, Tefila, uh, is going to be one year old. Hallelujah. And the testimonies and the feedbacks we are getting from people are highly encouraging. When we were starting Tefila, somebody was had been barren for 12 years. And at the very beginning of Tefila, the Lord answered the person. Hallelujah. And now she's a mother. I do not know what you have been waiting for, but you can have it tonight. Yes, no, you are not saying amen. Amen. To you. I said you can have it tonight. Amen. And you will have it in Jesus' amen. name. Amen. By the grace of God, I'll be talking on the topic. Even though we are in the month of our celebration, I have told you that it is better to celebrate. You can see them, pastors. It is better to celebrate in what? Knowledge. In knowledge. When you celebrate in knowledge, your celebration will endure. Mm. It will become generational. Yes, there are men that celebrate money. There are men that celebrate their spouses. There are people that celebrate their spouses. But here we are celebrating knowledge. And so I will be talking now, take advantage. As we are running now with Tefillah, we are praying for a whole year long, is that? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. But it is time for you to begin to look for advantage. There are men that don't recognize opportunities. An advantage is built around men. You must never allow Satan. Second Corinthians chapter 2, verse 11. He said, Do not allow Satan to take advantage of you. There are men that allow Satan. To take advantage of them. Second Corinthians chapter 2 verse 11. Do not allow Satan. To take advantage of you. So do not be ignorant. To be ignorant. Is to give a place. For the devil. To be ignorant is to pray in vain. There are people that know all the mountains in Nigeria and yet nothing is happening in their life. So it's not according to the multitude of your mountains. It's according to the weight of knowledge you possess in Christ. So the scripture says, do not allow Satan to take advantage of you. The Almighty God always wants us to take advantage of situations. There are men that have taken advantage of COVID-19. There is nothing you can do about it. COVID-19 has come and it has come. But there are men that are looking beyond what COVID, the damages COVID-19 had caused. They are searching for the opportunities that COVID-19 came with. There are people that are suddenly become multi-millionaire 
causing of COVID-19. They didn't invest you any money. They just looked for the opportunity that the COVID came with. And they exploit the opportunity. My people perish. Not because they are not prayerful. Not because they didn't do tefillah. They perish because they lack knowledge. Abi? Yes, sir. The book of Hosea. Chapter 4, verse 6. Men that pray. Men that know their God. That know their God. They don't run away from challenges. They confront challenges. And they win over challenges. Yoruba says, Mi ole waku. I don't want to die. Can never mount the throne of his father's house. Every situation comes with opportunity. There are don't there are several rich doctors called seal of sickness. Abi, yes, the only thing God does not want you to do is to take advantage of another Abi of another fellow. He doesn't want you to take advantage over any man negatively. That's what the Bible say. You know, Apostle Paul was talking in the book of Philemon, chapter one. It was saying to uh, about Onesimus. Abi, yes. he said to Philemon, he said this Onesimus, even though I want him, that's uh, chapter one, verse fourteen. He said, even though I want him to stay with me, because he said I will not do anything without your consent. I am your spiritual leader. Onesimus is your slave. I want him to stay with me, but I won't do anything without your consent. So God does never, he doesn't want us to take a negative advantage of one another. It does not matter how highly pledged you are. God doesn't want you to take advantage negatively over those that are working with you. He doesn't want you to take advantage negatively even over your children. But God wants us to take advantage of every situation. Galatians 6 from verse 9. You will see it there. The Bible says we should do good. We should never be tired of doing good. For in due season we shall reap if we faint not. And verse 10 says as we have therefore opportunity, let us do good to all men, because men are always against of advantage. You can be made outside men. Nobody, it does not. If you are speaking the language of God Himself, on that day, nobody can be made outside men. And that's why I've come to pray for you that men that will make you will locate you this month. Amen. You are not saying amen as if you are here. Amen. Isaiah 60 from verse 1, I will be reading verse 1 to 4. Isaiah 60 from verse 1. You will see that, you know, what is happening all over the world is not new. It has been predicted. It is in the Bible. Arise, shine, for the light is come. And the glory of the Lord is risen upon thee. Verse 2 says, for behold, darkness shall cover the head. 
including COVID. Is COVID not darkness? Yes, sir. Darkness shall cover the it said gross darkness. That means great darkness shall cover the people. But the Lord shall arise upon thee, and his glory shall be seen upon thee. I think somebody will say amen to that. Amen. Amen. Darkness is not new to God. Darkness was, he appeared in the book of Genesis chapter 1. No, it's not new. But God took advantage of darkness, and he made the light. Without darkness, there wouldn't be light. Yes, sir. So without challenges, men will not be raised. He said, grow darkness, the people boy say, but the Lord shall rise upon thee, and his glory shall be seen upon thee. Amen. Now, now in the presence of darkness, and God was talking about glory. God should first say, I will remove the darkness for your glory to shine. Did he say that? No. In the midst of that darkness, I will make you outstand. Amen. Oh, what are you talking about? But we are Christians that do not take advantage of situations. How will you be 40? How will you be? I keep saying it. And be blaming your misfortune on Buhari, on Jonathan. It's impossible. What, has it, what, are, what have they done to you? Do they even know your name? <laughs> Every man to his own time. Is that not what the Bible says? Yes, sir. When God outstands you, he said, and Gentiles shall come to thy light, and kings shall come to the brightness of thy reason. Is that not your right? Yes, sir. He said, lift up your eyes, round about, and see. All people shall gather themselves together. They will come to you. Thy son shall come from far. And thy daughter shall be nursed by thy sight. Darkness won't affect your daughter. Amen. It won't affect your son. Amen. They might be far away from you. They will come home without losing any of their any Amen. part of their body. They will come home with songs. Amen. They will come home with dancing. Amen. That's what the Bible says. Take advantage of this situation. <laughs> Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I will quickly tell you about men that survived and excelled against all hearts. Isaac in Genesis 26 verse 12 it was during famine that Isaac shined and he became a concern to a whole nation because he was different is that yes, sir. that same year same year where everybody was crying when everybody was lamenting, Isaac was harvesting in hundred fold. Because the Lord blessed them. The same, the same Nigeria, but different stories. You are to choose the story you want to tell. There are people that are already tracing their greatness to 2020. They are already celebrating God. Thank you for 2020. He said the kingdom of this world has become the kingdom of our God. A 
analyze it so. He took opportunity, he took advantage of the farming. And he got so connected with God, he partnered with God, and he became enviable. That becomes your portion. Amen. For Samuel chapter 17, verse 8 to 9. What was causing or that to hide? Abi, yes, showcase David. Others were hiding. At every sound of Goliath's voice, people were running into caves. But that was what show they saw Goliath as a threat. David came and saw Goliath as an opportunity. He took advantage of Goliath. In the month of August, this month of celebration, you will celebrate meaningfully. Amen. He said, choose a man and let him come down to me. If he wins over me, then we will serve you. But if I win over him, all is right. Shall the conflict. That statement was enough to make a man fret. Abi? Yes, sir. But somebody had they all had it. But somebody saw it as an opportunity. Somebody took advantage of over Goliath. And he became a national hero. He solved a national problem. He did what? You can now your God has said this thing before you were born. That there will be a time darkness will take over everywhere. He said, but upon you the light of God shall do what? All the trained armies with equipment were running. A boy without any equipment, but he was with God. And God was with him. He saw an opportunity in what they were running for. I decree. That the next time you appear among your mother's children, glory of God shall distinguish you. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. There is no day they are not, the government will announce that. Uh, we will build houses for everybody. Which day would that come? <laughs> Not even in this Nigeria. <laughs> even abroad. Now we, we spent years on Vision 2020. One plague dismantle everything. Gross darkness, the people. Gross darkness upon the whole nation. Joseph took advantage even in the prison. He interpreted the dream and the dreams he interpreted interpreted his own dream. The seven years of famine was an opportunity for Joseph to shine. Take advantage of situations. I asked from a boy that just graduated. I said, how did you? He came to me for prayer. I said, tell me about yourself. And he told me 
that when he got into the campus, he noticed that uh, several of his friends wanted to patronize a good barber. And he went into the act of learning it. He said that was what he used to transfer himself all through university. Is somebody here? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And there were people who in this year, in this Abi, Abi, May, that would drop out of school because no, there, Abi, there was no money. Yes, sir. But somebody took advantage of the prevailing need. It's not just all about praying. It's not all about sleeping on mountains. It's all about taking advantage of situations. You can't go sincerely into, into areas where the government had failed and not make it. Like school, like transportation, like health care, so many things. Where government has failed, go into it prayerfully. You would discover you will make it. Not, you can't go into it prayerfully and not make it. Abi? Yes, sir. God taught us so many things in the Bible. They were naked. He made what for them? He made a covering for them. He made he sealed clothes for them. So that tells you, men will always need clothes. Abi? Yes, sir. And God planted in the garden. Men will always need food. Yes, sir. So, think about it. And God planted whatever. Men will always need food. You can't go prayerfully into all those things and still fail. And Jesus rode on what? On, on an axe. Men will always need transportation. If you approach it prayerfully, you can't fail. You're still wasting your time and patronizing. Pastors from Nigeria to you understand, hey pastor, hey, the Lord, the Lord, no, take advantage. A pretty lady told me just recently what she does. She said, Pastor, COVID has taught me so many things. He said, Today I produce Ogi, pap, and she's making money. And it's your ballet, she be allowed, no you go. Call the shabby and they borrow a lot of that. Genesis forty one from verse twenty nine. He solved Joseph, solved the Shana problem and became a national hero. Take advantage. Take advantage, even as a pastor. Pastor, take advantage. Take advantage. I was shocked when people that sell, sell at the gates of this church, when they told me how much they make daily. During, ah, I said in this place, I mean people that were outside. Pastors here that are calling members to send credit mm. to their phones. <laughs> Every man runs away from a bonfire. Is that not true? Yes, but Moses confronted him and took advantage of it. He said, I will turn and see. He moved. Closer and God spoke. Men that run away from challenges are never made. 
Exodus 3 from verse 2. I will turn to see the body. And when God saw that he turned, instead of running away, God spoke and the mandate that made him was delivered unto him. The Red Sea was enough to turn them back. But the Red Sea was confronted. Take advantage, confront that situation in your marriage. The situation subdue your parents. Stand tall and confront the situation. And you will be shocked that you, through you, the Lord will set your generation free. And that becomes your portion. Amen. Amen. It's a matter of celebration. Amen. But I want us to be loaded with the required knowledge. If after the villa, you are still what you used to be, then you are most what? Men miserable. Exodus 1431. The was enough to turn anybody back. But that was what made, that was the opportunity the Lord gave to Moses so that his people would believe in him. And the Bible says, and they believed in God and they believed in Moses. And after that, and then sang Moses and the children of Israel. You cannot, in that's in chapter 50, verse 1. After confronting the situation, what followed was singing. What followed was what? Singing. The Lord in the wilderness took advantage of the Lord. He presented his five loaves of bread and two fishes. And he became a, re a renowned person. That is the book of Mark. Praise the Lord. John, rather, chapter 6, verse 9. John 6, 9. He became renowned. Esther saved his generation from genocide. Yes, sir. Abby? Yes, sir. And she became renowned. Now, what are you doing for your generation? What are you doing for your people? Now, do you... No, you can't just continue to beg. You can't continue to call everybody for your house rent. You did it last year. They thought they have helped you that to come out. Of, now, you, now you can't. If you are prayerful, your prayer must first help you. For the husband man should be the first one to get As a pastor, your prayer is not helping you, and you want your prayer to help me, then something is wrong. Because the Bible says you must be the first partaker. So stop calling people to send you to mountain to pray. If you can't perish, if you can't die for what you believe in, Abby, yes, sir. then you must not live for it. Mm -hmm. Esther said, if I perish, I, I perish. perish. Book of Esther, chapter 4, verse 16. If you can't die for what you believe in, then there is no need living for it. Stop supplanting people. Stop taking advantage of people. The wine that ran out are Canaan of what? Uh, you understand? At the wedding was an opportunity. That was the first miracle. Yes, sir. So men that pray, don't run away from challenges. I am provoking you today. 
go and think. I was already having money in, 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 in my little way then when I got married. I told my wife, I said, now you are looking for a job, but before you get, can you do something? And it was as 10,000 naira, not 10 million naira. I said, this is 10,000 naira. I want to see what you can make out of it. We did two weeks. I have a witness, Pastor Ajayi, what he said tonight. We did two weeks. She has turned 10,000 to 70,000. Going from one of these two, you understand, selling clothes. Selling clothes. Now don't. <laughs> Jesus was going after people. Is that not in your Bible? Yes, sir. Because he needed people to succeed. You, you want to sit down because you are, you are prayerful. You wake up and sleep and pray and read Bible and sleep and pray and you think eh, nothing will happen until you move. He told Moses, move forward. Stop crying. Until you move, there are seas that will never pass. Yes, Joshua needed to dip his feet into the river before it parted. But a lazy man would never do anything. He would say there is a lion. He said there is a lion on the road. So I can't go to the city. That's a lazy man. He will always tell you reasons why things cannot work. Is somebody here? Yes, sir. Before you know anything, People were already asking her, can you supply so so clothes? So, so she became a mini distributor. Cost still of 10,000 naira. But give 10,000 naira to somebody who will say, well, it's, it's so small. That same time I advised somebody to do something. And she told me, she will be importing things in container up to today. She has she she's here to import anything in my <laughs> Container. God himself that is almighty started Abi. He grew everything he was doing. In the first day, he could do everything at the same time. But he was doing it in bits. To tell you that you must do things in bits. This is your month of celebration. Amen. I said this is your month of celebration. Amen. Yeah, in this COVID now, there are, I, I know somebody, sir. There are these 10 courses online during COVID. 10 courses. 10 courses. And all your, all your, all your money was spent on data to watch off on video during COVID. <laughs> and some people did 10 courses. With their data. The Lord forgive you. Amen. All right, you could always show at a day. But you At least you are praying for a year now. So if it is the wishes and the wishes are still troubling you now, something is wrong. Will you love to pray this prayer? Yes, sir. Lord, open my eyes. Abi, to know what to do. He said, we will open the eyes of your understanding. Is somebody here? Yes, sir. I 
am sure there will be people around that goatee. When he was started, that will be mocking him. But it can't work. Don't you think? There are people that will always tell you reasons why things can't work. Those people there, I will be telling you tomorrow about who they are. I will be telling you about friends that should that that should that you should surround yourself with. Shall we rise for prayer? It's a month of our celebration. Amen. I said it's a month of our celebration. Amen. I said it's a month of our celebration. Amen. Amen. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. When preparation awaits opportunity, yes, sir. sir. Nobody can stop you. Who knew uh, Zoom before? Yes, sir. Or oh, the boy, the guy I've seen ahead of time. Now is what now yes, can sink a nation. Yes, yes, sir. Yes, yes. Talo ye kuru kin shall do right. Only wash and pray. Who should be looking for opportunity? Who should be looking for places of, of, of advantage? Is it not a, a, a prayerful person? Abraham, the father of faith, Abi, yes, sir. was a businessman. Abi, yes, sir. is that not in your Bible? Yes, he, the father of faith was a businessman. And because you cannot speak in tongues, you are sleeping, you're waking up, sleeping, waking up, not doing anything. The money you have used to buy the charge card this year. If you have used it to start a business, you won't be where you are now. Just because you want to belong. And you are not there. In fact, the people you are forcing yourself on, they don't see you. They are not seeing you. When they mention their friends, they don't mention your name. You are the one mentioning their name. They don't mention your own name. Lord, open my eyes. I told you, opportunities are a man. Must I, should I say this again? Men are carriers of opportunity. Open my eyes, oh God. To see opportunity. Go ahead and pray aloud now. Lord, open my eyes to see opportunity. In the north, in the south, in the west, in the east. Oh Lord, open my eyes. Maroba shederia barobo kato kata. Jere de ge de ge de ge de ge de ge de bosh. Open my eyes, oh God. Open my eyes, oh God. To see opportunity. Mele bromo shaka talaba. Mege de ge de ge de ge de bosh. Mege re de ge de boson doria. Bradegesha. Bradegesha. Open my eyes, oh God. To see opportunity. E kula badaba daba. In this month of celebration, oh Lord. Open my eyes, oh God. Open my eyes, oh God. Mele promo sondaria. Malelelelelele bosh. Open my eyes, oh God. E pro de ge de ge de ge bosh. Maraba de ge de ge bosh. E pra de ge de ge de bosh. Open my eyes, oh Lord. Ma sandaria brama sotolia. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen.
this is a time where I mean when nations are groaning. Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. I can tell you that God still raises me mm -hmm. in spite all hearts. Pray the spirit. Yeah. Lord, Lord. raise me by yourself. Raise me by yourself. In the mighty Go ahead and pray that prayer now. Lord, raise me, Lord. Raise me by yourself. In this moment of celebration, give me reasons to celebrate. Mekono boshata laba. Meraba de gede gede bosh. Mege de promo sontolia. Masko do rebo shandaria ba. Imporobo sontolia ba shandaria. Ange de promo kotola baraba. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Now, do you know? Let me tell you that secret. The secret to a greater tomorrow is starting where you are. Starting where? Where you are. Somebody came to me just recently and shared a vision with me of how she wants to, she's planning to have a great home for the less privileged. I laughed. I said, how much do you have? Do you earn monthly? She told me. I said, how many people eat already from what you are earning? We go stop deceiving yourself. If thou art faithful over the little, I will commit, Abi. Yes, sir. How many people are eating from what? It is God that does all those things. You can't build it by yourself. We follow the marriage. But when God sees that the little you are having, at least you are making some people to laugh, to smile, then God will know, ah, this, if I should enlarge this coast, Abi, yes, sir. it will do more. That's how people move higher. But if it is you, my wife, even your wife will be advising you. Eh, my dear, come go well. I hope daddy, daddy, what? What are you not going to do? Hello, no, 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 no. I hope you're not saying she wants to allow the buyer to get with him. We are not any my dear. We turn you because economy, like she, you are, you are so sure. Oh, good to move what the other. Badura. Unua. Lord, show me the next step to take. I am ready to take it. Show me the next step. Oh, yeah, go ahead and pray the prayer now. Lord, show me the next step to take. Mekula Badabosa. Oh, Lord. Mele bro me soto la badaba. The next step. The next step, oh, Lord. The next step, oh, Lord. Show me, O oh Lord, the next step to take. Make a nebo robo shatanaba. O Lord, order my step. Order my step, O oh Lord. Show me the next step to take, O oh Lord. Mele brama koso tola bashandaria. Show me, O Lord, the next step to take. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Finally, I want you to celebrate God. This is a month of our celebration. Yes, celebrating. The Fila is a year this month. Let us go ahead and celebrate God for peace, for keeping us all through the Fila. No evil news. No accidents. Lord, we celebrate you. Lord, we celebrate you. Lord, we give you praises. Makolobo satalaba. Egedeva riaba suntuli abrana gadaba. Brade gede 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 bosh. Masendeli abrama kusuntuli abashada. Eba ne gede 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 bosh. Mego do brane gede bosha. Araba de gede 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 bosh. 
Oh Lord, oh Lord. Maraba de gede 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 bosh. Maribo bosh andaliaba. Empra de gede bosh. Maribo sodoliaba soda. Marobo sodoliaba soda. Makolobo sodolia. So shall it be in Jesus' name. Amen. I decree that what you need to do that will change your fortune for good. Within the next three days, in this month of celebration, your eyes will be opened unto you. I said your eyes will be opened unto it. You are covered with the blood of Jesus. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Jesus. See you tomorrow. God bless you.